We have taken our strategy on a national tour covering all parts of the UK to meet with our many stakeholders and partners to understand how we can best work with them to deliver for the UK. Our six strategic objectives are brought to life by our principles for change that underpin all of them. We need to think very hard about the diversity of institutions, people, places, and that diversity is no use whatsoever unless it's properly connected. So diversity with connectivity then brings us a resilient and flexible system to cope with new challenges and also new opportunities. And then the fourth one is engagement. People need to own it. That's the full loop that I hope we can drive as One UKRI with our many communities and stakeholders across the UK. Today we're in Newcastle as part of a visit to the North East region and very much our principles for change are evident in the many people that I've met so far. Some really exciting and inspiring people working on a huge range of different projects. Yesterday I was at the Centre for Process Innovation hearing about how you can innovate in manufacturing to produce the 21st century's key products from those RNA vaccines that were so critical in the pandemic through to new battery technologies that are going to be crucial in our energy transition. I've been at the universities of Northumbria and the University of Newcastle in the context of all the universities in the region coming together to work collaboratively for the local economy and public services, which has been fantastic. Clearly uh, here is a centre for ageing research, which is a, an issue critical for all of us across the world as we live healthier for longer. So UKRI is funding uh, various different parts of our research portfolio, from delivering training of the next generation of researchers to projects that are addressing complex challenges and also consortia so that we can get together and work across disciplines to solve complicated big problems that we need to address for the benefit of society. There are so many opportunities for working here in the Northeast. Uh, the energy sector is going to be huge, partly because of offshore wind. But there's also uh, wider work on the transition to net zero, which is happening all across this region, whether that might be around batteries or driving the electric revolution or the circular economy. All of this is fantastic stuff. UKRI is playing a really important role supporting research and innovation here in the northeast of England. Um, one example for me is the focus on place particularly. Here in Newcastle we're working with our partners on a project which is called Insights Northeast which connects academic researchers with public policy makers to make sure that we're going to have much better evidence-based policy making in the future. It's a great project that's collaborative and has been supported by uh, Research England. We have a lot of expertise also in um, data and, and digital and culture and creative arts. I think it's really important to think about the, how those different disciplines can come together in a place-based complex and really make a difference. We have serious economic, social and global challenges to face. The existence of UKRI is the opportunity to get on the front foot, feeding into then the UK economy to build the development of those public services and also our, our economic future. We are the engine for that activity and we need to step up to that mark. It's a huge responsibility, um, but also a huge um, opportunity and a privilege to be able to do that.